Hi and welcome to the Shave Tank. So, a few questions and tips first and then we go to the next part of our Soap Commander series. It's not Soap Commander series, but Soap Commander series. Uh, a few questions. Uh, someone asked in the comments, what are you doing if you're taking these sample soaps, for example, like Soap Commander, like we do today, you press them in your mug, what do you do with the leftovers in the mug? Or in the paper. Well, quite easily said, I'll shave with them. So usually I get two shaves out of what I put in the mug. So I shave two for two days with the same soap. And then I'll use the soaps that are left over in the papers. Uh, every now and then because they're really really awesome and I think I will get at least 10 12 shades out of each sample so really nice um, then small announcement is I got a little cut here again but this time it was not the kitty this time it was a new straight racer I'm testing not telling you which maybe it will be on soon um, and yeah, it was the classic mistake. My finger that I was stretching my skin with was really wet, which is not good. Dry your fingers. Stretching is really important. The stallion always says so. And what happened was like this, zoop, and the cheek rubbed against the razor. Yep. Yeah. S.C. heat happens. You know, but yeah, that's that. Then a few people were concerned with my hair. No, it's nothing serious. It was just, it has around uh, 40 degrees Celsius, which, uh, or even more, and which maybe I think like 100 degrees or something Fahrenheit or more. <laughs> and yeah, so it's really, really hot. And I have this mentholated head cream. So that keeps me cool in the head. But now for the next episode of Soap Commander. And since I have a few very nice things upcoming and you can't have enough ever, today we're going with Wisdom. And I put some in the mug already. Very pepperminty, I have to say, but not like this uh, chewing gum peppermint, which I don't like because it's so too sweet. This is more like real peppermint. And I think it has some floral undertones in there. Can't, couldn't, can't really say which. Definitely not rose, but... Uh, Lavender maybe, yeah, it's very floral, but the peppermint is definitely dominating, yeah. But a very nice, very strong smell, so that's that's really good. And we are going to level this up again with the L'Occitane Blisson. Still one of my favorite brushes. And here we go. And as always with Soap Commander, you see the phone really explodes. And so does the peppermint smell. Really nice peppermint scent. I don't know why peppermint always also reminds me of some grassy green stuff but yeah maybe because peppermint is green so. <laughs> just a little bit of water and as always 
we get here some very nice slickness to the whole thing. Yeah, so Commander really shines when it comes to slickness and ease of leathering. Awesome, really awesome wisdom. We wet the face. Hopefully, we don't shave over the cut because that won't be good. So yeah, really, my really first really nasty cut with the straight, but my own fault. Maybe I should put a little elm on the finger. Next time, so stretching gets a little bit easier. So yeah, it's really hot outside, really nasty. And to shave this off, we're gonna use the Razor Rock Stealth Slant. Same from the review, still same blade in the second shave on that blade. And here we go. And again, I really like that razor, the glide on the soap. Awesome. Really easy, nice shave. Uh, some people were saying that I was bashing Razor Rock because uh, the slants and everything is not in stock all the time. It's not meant as bashing. It's merely wishful thinking. I just expressed my wishes that I really wish that Joe would make those available soon. I know he does a lot for the shaving community. And he does innovate a lot. He also has always, in my opinion, made sure that when he comes out with a product, it's ready. I really like the other razors. Love the slab and the mission, for example. Really like that. Didn't have a baby smooth yet, so can't comment on that. But yeah, I really wish those were more was easily available but I totally understand why he does it the way he does it so it was not a complaint more a wish so that's that And this uh, soap, I have to say, the peppermint smell is really, really nicely, not, you can't say really increasing, it's flowing in the air. And there are definitely some floral notes around which is really nice, really good. Oh, 
Uh, someone has also asked, will you shave your head? I don't know yet. I'm undecided. If you think I should, leave a comment. in the video and I might consider it so far most of the people seem to like the new hairstyle And it doesn't remind me how old I am. <laughs> because all the grey hair are gone. Very nice second bath. With the baby smooth, the, uh, with the stealth, the cheek area is baby smooth even after the second bath. It's really awesome. But we'll do a little touch up just for the heck of it the fun thing also about this soap is that even though it's peppermint and not menthol it really has a refreshing tone to it, which I really like. Really nice one. Nice and easy going here. Awesome! I have to say, well, no surprises there. So Commander really performed again really nicely. Scent again really cool. Both J feel is awesome. Really nice. Really like that. We'll freshen it up with some cold mountain water. especially in the weather <laughs> and to cool it off even more I will use again a soap commander balm ingredients are basically the same as last time so I'm still using this and today it's inspiration because I feel a little fruity <laughs> but this is the mentholated version again so oh, here is the opening we are going with a little menthol kick in the heat of the summer here and already you can smell the really nice grapefruit from the inspiration really like that. It's 
It's an awesome fruity scent. Again, it's probably too much I'm using here. Yeah, way too much. Rinse off my hands a little bit. There isn't really a lot of menthol in it. Just enough to give you this nice cooling sensation. So way less, for example, than with Uh, Burrazo has a lot more mental kick than this. And again, the post shave feel on this is really, really nice. So, again, a win for Soap Commander. Thanks for watching. Let's high five and see you soon.